Hey everyone, Argle Funf here, playing Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney, Spirit of Justice. We are examining the victim's home. And wow, this seems... relevant. So the first mountain is really, really close to the murder scene. So it's 12... 12 meters higher. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice mountain. Okay, and that is something you have to look at because that gets added to your uh, court record. So is there anything else I absolutely have to look at? I feel like there's something I have missed. What is this? That, that looks scary. It looks like the back of Phoenix's head. And I think I see something. What is this? Yeah, and it's got three holes in it. Three holes, yeah. Just like that letter that Maya found on the victim's body. Maybe the letter came inside that envelope. I can read, just not your language. Hmm. Well, it looks like we found everything. That is, we found the poster and we found the envelope. Oh, is she going to talk to us now? Alrighty, so I want to talk to her about the arrow. I came here to talk to her about that. The three-pronged arrow, I, I can't help but think that was how the envelope letter was delivered. And she is not saying anything at all about it. Well, what about the envelope then? Oh wow, she's not... She's not saying anything. Okay, fine. Well, let's not present evidence to her. She seems to not want to talk about evidence. So let's just talk to her about the victim. Uh-oh. What the? Ah! Cyclox? Okay, well, this is the Magatama that Phoenix has from game number two. Phoenix right justice for all. Basically, it allows him to see if somebody's lying to him. And she's kind of lying to him now. So you use the X button in order to do this, this feature. It's, it's a nice little gameplay feature. 
Basically what we're going to do is we're going to have a series of questions. It's sort of like we're interrogating someone. So somebody does have a grudge against your husband, huh? So let's stir the pot a little, see what comes up. So who had a reason to kill her husband? I would say it's the escaped prisoner. Maya was unconscious at the time, so no, she wouldn't have been killed. Okay, so that was the wrong answer. Let's say that it's uh, Lady Kira. Whoa. That's, that's creepy. So why would uh, the rebel hunter want to kill him? Presumably, Phoenix is talking about this letter, this 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 warning letter from Lady Kira. So that's how psych locks work. When we when we get closer to the truth, the psychs lock the psych locks are destroyed. Oh man, evidence that it was meant for your husband. Okay, so here I think the evidence is that envelope. The envelope with the, the three three holes in it. And yeah, 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 this is what I was just talking about. I think, I think the arrow, I might have to present the arrow here. Okay, so I'm gonna point out, point out those three holes, obviously, that's what Phoenix is talking about. So what made the holes is obviously that, that, that arrow. So let me get to the arrow. Take that. The war bad arrow. So we finished our first psych lock challenge. Now, now we can get the truth. What is the truth? Hmm, okay. So she kept it a secret because he might have been accused of being a rebel. Okay, well that explains, that explains it, yeah. Phoenix seems to think that is not what explains it. Phoenix seems to think that 
the victim was secretly a rebel. Let's not mention this in front of the victim's wife. Yeah, let's let's not talk to her about that, okay, Phoenix? 